Hey, for those of you needing audio description, we're starting this vlog with images of the open road on the way to Stratford-upon-Avon until we eventually finish at the Royal Shakespeare Company. Hey, ignore the mess over there, I'm unpacking. Hang on a minute, I should probably introduce myself. Hello. Sup. Hi. Oh, hi there. Hey. Ah. Alright. <sighs> Hello, I'm Amy Trigg and this is my first vlog. I am an actress currently working for the Royal Shakespeare Company, so this vlog is kind of going to be documenting my experience with the company over the next year and a bit. I've often wanted to vlog and people have asked me if I've considered starting it, but I always felt a bit awkward because I didn't know where to begin. And then this came up and I thought, yay, perfect thing to start vlogging and I'll quite enjoy looking back on it, I'm sure. I also wanted a creative project to be running alongside work because I'm working away from home. I wanted something to occupy myself on lonely evenings. I'm trying to make this vlog as accessible as possible. Um, so we're gonna have subtitles. I don't know if I'm pointing in the right place. This is what YouTubers do, right? And we're going to try audio description. Now, I, I've done a little bit of audio description in the past, but I am no expert. So if you're out there and you're like, Amy, <laughs> what are you doing? Please just comment or send me a message and tell me that I should probably not be doing that particular thing and should try something else. I'm totally up for hearing about that. I've heard it's not cool to do a thumbs up anymore and I have weird thumbs. Amy is 4 foot 11, a wheelchair user with brown curly hair. She's a white female and wears glasses. And yeah, she's got weird thumbs. Back to the blog. Today, I arrived in Stratford and had a wig fitting. I put on my wig and not gonna lie to you guys, I looked amazing. I'm not ashamed to say it, I looked like a Disney princess. I looked in the mirror and I thought, yeah, this is the woman I was always meant to be. Apparently that's not what they want from the character, so I'm not wearing the Disney princess wig and that's fine. Fine. Although I'm not wearing a wig, I got to see all the wigs in the room and they're stunning. I didn't record my wig fitting because I didn't want to give anything away at this stage and lots of things change. I could end up in a wig for all I know and I might do for when I'm, if I'm on my understudy part, <laughs> when I'm on, watch out Laura. The biggest news from today is that I managed to get a vegan sausage roll from Greg's if you haven't tried them. Oh lordy. Very, very nice. I've had about six in the last two weeks. To people that vlog with glasses, like, how do you get rid of these green things? The lights. I mean, I don't mind them. I think they look quite jazzy. Oh, I think I might just have to vlog at this angle from now on. Fortunately, I don't have any neck or back problems, so that's gonna be fine. I should probably explain that, actually, because some of you might not get that joke. I was born with spine bifida, um, so I'm a full-time wheelchair user, manual wheelchair user. In fact, she's a bit of a mess at the moment, but there she is. Um, he is, sorry. Titus, his name is. Got a new cup holder. Very exciting. So last night we went to see the As You Like It press night. Uh, my dad came with me and we had a really cool evening. My three-word review is wish I'd thought about this before I started filming. Um, joyous, playful, and creative. They're my three words. I could go on, but I'm gonna stick with that and be stripping myself. Very excited to see it again already. Like I could go back tonight, to be honest. I didn't film much last night because I wanted to enjoy the party and also I'm still a bit apprehensive about shoving a camera in people's faces, but they'll get used to it. It was, however, Charlie's birthday. So Aaron, who is brilliant, arranged a birthday surprise. Aaron arranged for two of Charlie's favorite songs to play. So it was Thinking Out Loud, Ed Sheeran, and Raw, Katy Perry. Tom, who is excellent, he signed the songs and taught us the BSL for the choruses. So thank you, Tom. We had a cake come out and we sang happy birthday, and signed happy birthday. And I think Charlie was quite surprised. You know what? I'm doing a really terrible job of explaining this. Here's a video. So These videos show a group of people signing songs to Charlie who stands in front of the crowd next to a pair of speakers. Yeah, 
Today we had a line run uh, of Taming of the Shrew and it went well. It went well. Yeah. Ah. We, we, we know what we're doing. We've now got the weekend off. My parents are still up so we're probably going to end up doing some touristy things. Yeah. I reckon. Okay, we're heading into a montage of Stratford-upon-Avon. It is sunny and we're seeing the river and we're seeing Amy's dog who is a poodle cross and absolutely gorgeous. We're seeing Amy waving at the camera, but it's just her shadow, edgy. More of Amy's dog being very excited and some buskers on the street. We've got more water, because why not? And we've got sunlight creeping through the trees and swans, lots of swans. And we're going back to, yeah, Amy's dog waving at the camera and more water, more swans and a church. That's it for this week. That's it for my first vlog. Did it. <sighs> the crowd goes wild. Nailed it. If you like this vlog, then please subscribe and tell your mates. If you didn't like this vlog, but you think that I show promise, then subscribe and tell your friends anyway. If you have any suggestions or if you have any questions or you have ideas for videos that you'd like to see, then please let me know. I don't know when my next vlog is going to be out. Hopefully I'm going to do these weekly, but if things get busy, I might not hit that target. Sorry. So I shall see you when I see you. Have a lovely time and be kind. <laughs> Maybe I'm a professional vlogger now. I don't know. Oh, the marketing team are going to be so thrilled that they asked me to do this, aren't they? They're going to be full of regrets.